Today, I'm riding out to Queens, New York to meet the man who makes the largest gingerbread villages in the world. Hey! Good to see you, man. Good How to are you? Good to see you. The gingerbread man. I am the gingerbread man. This is my humble gingerbread abode. I know. It kind of looks like one. Well, do you want to see the room where I do it all? All right. Let's do it. This is my gingerbread kingdom. You or what's left of it. You quite the shit over this, here. This is the gingerbread island of misfit toys at this point. But at one point, <laughs> this was indeed the gingerbread kingdom. So full-time gingerbread artist. And I'm pretty sure I'm the only one in the world. I keep telling myself, for this moment in time, I'm probably the only guy on this planet getting paid to make gingerbread villages. And how much can some of these sell for? The most I've ever sold one for is $31,000. $31,000? That's incredible. So you're absolutely passionate yeah. about oh, yeah. gingerbread. And then some. I've been working until about 4 in the morning usually, because I'm very nocturnal. This is where it all starts, and then we're going to head to one of the exhibitions. Are you yeah. going to ride your bike over? Definitely. All right, good deal. I'll <laughs> see you there. <laughs> The gingerbread lane here. They let me bring my bike in the museum. Look at this. Incredible. I've biked all over the country, but never seen a town like this. Starts in that little apartment, ends up here at a museum. This is Gingerbread Lane. This is the world's biggest gingerbread village. It's about 1,200 gingerbread houses behind me, all edible, all entirely made out of gingerbread icing and candy, all whimsical, all holiday themed. Got a lot of stuff in the village. It's actually named after people I know. I've got multiple houses for my fiance, my grandfather, good friends from Groundhog Day, everything. Oh, ex relatives even are in here. You gotta look at all these little things. Like you got pies on here, you got staircases, you got doors, there's a turkey made of Pez. It's the trolley car here, it tells you the trolley's going to Eggnog Bay. In, in a world that we live in where there's just so much negativity and bad stuff going on, to be able to every year create something that, you know, some, in some years, three quarters of a million people come and see in person and love it. That's great. I mean, I created that. That's awesome. Thanks so much Absolutely. for having us.